Good morning. It's Monday. We get to start another week. Lovely. So it's gorgeous weather. It's going to be 81 degrees today, later this afternoon. I'm already in a tank top. That's how warm it is outside. So I'm not complaining. I love this weather. Um, Seattle area got dumped on as of all through last night. When I talked to my mom a couple hours ago, it was still kind of snowing a little bit. 80,000 people are without power, including her, and power probably won't be restored until sometime late tonight, maybe tomorrow. So my mom said they had around close to six inches in that area. Some had more, it depends on where you lived, but I mean, all kinds of schools are closed, and my dad made it into work this morning, but he's probably gonna have trouble getting home. Because the snow that they have, it's that heavy, wet snow. And so today I'm really excited. Today I have a friend coming to visit. His name is Stormy, and he should be here later on this afternoon between like one and three o'clock. So I'm just, you know, took a shower. I'm gonna go get all ready for him and wait for him to show up. Got something in my eye. All right, well, I was out there with the dogs, but it was a little bit windy, and I didn't know if that would mess with the microphone or not, because sometimes when we go for a walk and it's windy, you can hear the wind. So I came inside while they do their business, but I'm all ready to go for the day. I'm gonna get some lunch, make myself a nice healthy salad, and then I need to head to the grocery store. I am really trying to incorporate more veggies in with our dinners, like asparagus, broccoli, cauliflower, carrots, you know, some vegetables to go with our dinner instead of just like mashed potatoes and canned vegetables, so more fresh. So I'm gonna work on that, so that's on my list. Also wanna get some fruits. I wanna get some oranges, apples, and bananas, and maybe grapes if they're in season. And uh, possibly maybe some corn on the cob. It is lunchtime! Yummy, yummy salad. Unfortunately, I'm all out of veggies, so I have lots of lettuce, some sunflower seeds, and some croutons, and a little bit of ranch dressing. They also have a few baked potato chips. Um, I counted them all out, so it's portion size. And then I also have a crystal light pink lemonade. And when I drink a little bit more, I can add some ice to it. So I'm back home, I'm done doing my errands. I'll show you what I got at Walmart. I also went to the thrift store today and I found a few things. And then also a few days back before the weekend, I found some things at the thrift store that I'll also stick in here and show you what I got. I completely forgot to show you that day in that video. So, um, and then Stormy is here. So when I'm done doing all that, then I will introduce you to Stormy. So when I ran to Walmart, I got some asparagus and some broccoli to go with our dinner tonight. I really want a cauliflower, but it was brown and sad looking. So maybe I'll try to get some tomorrow at a different location, maybe even a Kroger. String cheese, four of the vanilla Yoplait yogurts, one gal apple and three bananas. Nobody had my Starbucks breakfast blend on sale. Steve gets these and takes them to work and he says he likes them, so I'll give them a try. And then some lettuce to make salads. I used the last of it at lunchtime. And then I got some more of these deli snackers, the ham and the rotisserie chicken, and these are really good for an evening snack. Steve and I will share one bag with crackers and the chicken would be 30 calories for each of us, and the ham would be 40. So yeah, it's a good snack. We really like these. If you can find these in the stores, they're, they're really tasty. At the thrift store, I found this t-shirt. It's blue, and then this part's green, and this one's like lime green. And then the back is really nice. Just a nice, good outdoor, just everyday workout shirt. And then a hand towel for the kitchen, another one, and then I needed another pillowcase for the one that I have on the couch. So that's what I found today. Now I'll go in and show you what I found the other day. But um, the other stuff is in the other room. Um, I got this floaty for $250, and we already have a blue one, so now we have a pink one. So 
Steve can take over the blue one, even though blue is my favorite color, and I won't make him go into the pink one. I'll have the pink one here, but now I'm going to go into the other room and show you what else I got. All right, so I had found some clothes. I had already hung them up, and some are just laying around here. So um, I found this tank top. Isn't it super, super nice? And it was on clearance at Kohl's. I got this for $3.50, and I just thought it was really nice. It's really nice material, nice and soft. And, yeah, it looked good with some uh, shorts or capris. Then I found this tank top. This is striped with a darker blue and a lighter blue. Well, here's Stormy. He made it to Texas. I'm so excited. Stormy is a traveling teddy bear, and he has already visited his first family, and we are the second family that he gets to visit, and he gets to go visit many other families. So we get to watch Stormy and where he gets to go and his adventures. Um, many of you know who Stormy is and some of you don't, so if you don't know who Stormy is, I will leave the channel link down below. The storms are here and you can watch that video and learn about Stormy and who he is and what he's all about. Alright, so I'm just going to put Stormy here and he brought me some presents. But first, he brought me a card, so we're going to open this up. It says, thank you for your hospitality. And inside it says, I just want to say thank you so much for having me come visit you all. You are welcome, Stormy. Then we have some fine hazelnut chocolates. Yummy. And then we have a six-piece votive candle set. That is very, very nice. Thank you, Stormy. I know exactly where I'm going to put these. Um, and I will show you later on where I'm going to display them. Thank you, Stormy. And then lastly, Stormy carries a diary with him so we can write each day a few sentences about his stay. Well, okay, Stormy, are you ready to start this fun adventure with Cheryl and family? He's ready. So I just showed Stormy around our house and he really likes our home. And we were just kind of brainstorming, figuring out what he wanted to have for dinner tonight. And he decided he wanted to have his first Texas barbecue. So I took some chicken out, and we're going to marinate that in some barbecue sauce later on and have ourselves a nice, yummy barbecue dinner. And now he's kind of hungry. So we decided to have some scoops potato chips and some of my dip that I made over the weekend. And he really likes it. Steve just got home from work. Stormy's been enjoying his stay. We've been just hanging out. I've been doing some work on the computer and he's just been hanging out with me. But we're going to go for a bike ride. We're going to leave Stormy here with Ryan. Get a little bit of babysitting time. And then we're going to come back home and make some dinner. Well, good evening. I am meeting Stormy for the very first time. And hello, Stormy. We're glad that you finally made it to Texas. We've been waiting for you for a while. But we're glad that you're here. And one of the things that we do in Texas is we barbecue. So tonight, you can help me. We're going to barbecue some chicken. Got the grill going. Charcoals are starting to heat up. So we'll have a great time um, barbecuing some chicken and some asparagus. And I'm not sure if that's something that you'll like. I hope so. Um, Got to enjoy that Texas barbecue. So we're glad you're here and hope you enjoy your stay with us. So Stormy's all excited to have his first Texas barbecue. He has some chicken and asparagus. He's super happy. And we are just going to have ourselves a good dinner tonight. We're all done eating dinner. And boy, did Stormy enjoy that barbecue chicken. But just FYI, he does not like asparagus. Yep, he does not like it. All right, so Stormy had a really good evening with us. Dinner went well. He was a good helper. He's getting tired because he had a big trip here. So we're going to tuck him in so he has a good night's rest for tomorrow. We have some more things planned. You'll have to wait and see. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up for Stormy, and we'll see you all tomorrow. Night.